So hello guys, Rapidamixus here. Um, yeah, so I'm still working on UV Reactor and I decided to make uh, update videos every two weeks or maybe once a month. It depends on how occupied I'm. So I would like to show you a couple of things that I'm, I'm working on recently. Uh, as you may know, I'm working on the UV packing algorithm and uh, yeah, just, oh, the outcome is just pretty good. Uh, also, I would like to show you the speed of it because it is way more important and there is another interesting thing which I would like to show you and it is that it's almost perfectly poly count independent and then you will see what that thing that means. Okay, so here is the model. It's just almost 20,000 polygons and yeah, I, I'm just gonna move the UV shells aside so you can see that I'm not cheating or anything else. Um, uh, you will see that it's really blazing fast. So just a quick note about the local algorithm. It is an OpenGL based algorithm and it's multi-threaded and that's one of the reasons why it's so fast although it's really fast on a single thread as well. Uh, I will show you that as well later. So here is the UV, which I, we are planning to pack. And yeah, we are packing the entire thing on six cores. And here's the thing, just uh, 662 milliseconds. And the update time were just 39 milliseconds. The update time is just to move uh, the vertices into the appropriate place. So it, it is more of a, a 3D CDMX related thing. And here comes the polygon independent part. This is a subdivided model uh, based on this one. And it's uh, more than, uh, not more, less than 300,000 polygons, but it's still way too much. So as you can see, it's really dense. It's really, really dense mesh. Uh, I'm moving these side as well so we see I'm not cheating just doing this or this one for example okay so I move these aside and here is the thing 758 milliseconds if I run it again <laughs> 700 yeah so there is a bit of a variation between uh, the performance sometimes but yeah it's really really fast and it's really really almost exactly the same as it was before here at 662 and actually we have 10, 10 times 15 times more polygons than than on, on the less than mesh and i just wanted to show you the uh single threaded version because it's also interesting that it has been packed in 622 milliseconds and if I'm just using a single thread it takes 1.2 seconds so it is twice as fast uh, if we're using almost all the cores uh, yeah so that was one of the things I wanted to show you uh, and yeah it is a resolution based system so if you lower this value you, you get less precision but you are gaining a lot of additional performance yeah so that's what i wanted to show you uh, as i mentioned before i'm planning to create more videos as i'm working on the system and if you have ideas if you have requests just visit my discord channel you can leave there your comments your ideas whatever you want and um, i'm trying to make them uh, a real thing uh, i hope you like this small video and this small update i'm trying to uh, make more sooner or later it depends on how much time i have so uh, please forgive me if i don't make it <laughs> every single month or every single week. So I hope you enjoyed this video and see you next time.